bulk of the work that Dr. Dimitri Katz uh, has been doing is around uh, the use of niacin, uh, the vitamin B3, and specifically flush niacin. And the reason it's called flush niacin is because they haven't messed around with the chemicals um, of straight up natural vitamin B3. And so what it does is um, it creates a, a feeling of flush in the body and um, can actually get sort of, it looks like, it can look like you've got blotchy sunburn. Um, and one should build up a, um, a tolerance um, to higher doses. Um, but it, it is very useful in that it creates um, a perfusion. It creates blood flow uh, that, that really goes out and um, goes all the way into the tiny microcapillaries, pushing blood and oxygen um, and um, into, into, the, uh, into the ends, really, um, of, of vessels. And so that's why you can get this, uh, you know, sort of um, sunburned-like uh, look for, a, it can last a couple of minutes, a couple of hours. Um, it's not the most comfortable feeling, but it's also not the most uncomfortable feeling. Um, but I would um, encourage people to look at the work of Dimitri Katz. Um, I think his protocol is called the homeostasis uh, protocol, and he's done phenomenal work. And lately what he's been doing, uh, which helps me to segue, is that all of these um, detox and, and, and different protocols, um, central to all of them um, is the reliance on the fat-soluble vitamins, vitamins A, D, E, K, 2. I cannot emphasize this. I've been talking about this for over two years. The immune system building blocks are vitamins A, D, E, K, um, um, and specifically K2, but there's, uh, there's good use in being able to use K1 and K2. And you know, what's interesting for me is that I love learning new things um, each day around substances and, um, and useful supplements um, that we've all been familiar with. But the word vitamin comes from uh, the words, uh, original words, vital amines. And so, you know, I was looking at the amines, for example, um, uh, when you talk about fluvox amine um, and some of the other amines that are used in, uh, in the treatment of bio warfare, amines become really important. You can think about amines as nitrogen hooks, you know, almost like you've created a net that goes out and starts helping to, to balance out the nitrogen in the body. And so amines become really important. And if you think about vital amines, vitamins, you know, then you can suddenly realize that you're not playing games with supplements. Uh, supplements are a, a, a key form of survivability on this planet. Um, as uh, Bill Gates and others deplete our farms of its nutrition, um, we're going to be relying uh, more and more on, on, on 